Hi guys, before we get started, my friend Linda is trying to hit her goal of 1000 subscribers by the end of the year. So um, her channel is Linda Jewelry Collections and more. I will leave it out right here somewhere, a link to it or a picture. Let's help her out. Let's help her hit her goal before, uh, before the end of the year. All right. Thank you. And again, I would like to thank every single one of you for joining my family, the family of your vintage beauties. We have a lot of fun here. We'll have a lot of giveaways here. We just recently had one. If you like um, going through jewelry and hunting for treasures like I do, please consider joining us and subscribing. It's free. You can just click on the red button or actually gray button or red button. I think it's a red button until it becomes gray. And once it becomes gray, consider yourself a part of the family. Okay? <laughs> see <laughs> how I said that? Okay. All right. Let's see. Oh, yeah. We did get those here. Here. Um... Uh, one more thing I was going to say to you guys is everything in uh, my videos um, is for sale, unless I state it otherwise. Um, sometimes if I fall in love with something, I'll just say, oh no, I'm going to keep it. But usually everything is for sale. I don't say prices um, during my videos because I, I just don't feel comfortable. My price is quite low, so yeah um and um if you want to know anything or you would like to purchase anything or just acquire sizes or length or me testing it please email me at your vintage beauties at gmail.com my email usually in the description um below in the description box under the video it's right there or i can just put it on the screen all right, so this is these are um, earrings. They kind of a rose gold hoops, you know, for pierced ears. And of course, we got second one of those. This kind of cute chandeliers, very pretty, bronzy with rhinestones, also for pierced ears. I don't see any names, but they're pretty cute. Look how cute they are. Pretty cute. Kind of a Middle Eastern, I think, remind me a little bit. Or Indian. Right here we have kind of a cuff, um, seed beads, orange color, a memory wire, very pretty bracelet. Very cute. This one says made in China, gold tone bracelet watch. you wear it like I wonder how you like oh ma'am now what time it is oh let me take a look oh it's whatever blah blah it's pretty cool don't you think so Zenata I think it says Zenata let's see oh my goodness let's see oh my yeah Zenadu Zenadu Chords, Japan, I think, right? Japan movement, yeah. Uh, Mother of Pearl, kind of a backing. Pretty cool. Very good condition. Two tone, gold tone, and silver tone. Huh, interesting. Uh oh. We have a rhinestone, fell out of something. We'll keep it on the side. We'll see. What do we have here? Oh, it's the uh, oh hair hair. It's kind of a, like also very interesting set. Maybe Indian. Let's turn on Presidium. Okay, so we have a necklace. Oh my goodness, so pretty. This is not from here. All the rhinestones are here. I want to test this. This ones are glass. Very pretty gold tone closure oh my goodness look how pretty this is and right here we have earrings i'm not quite sure this is real i think this is acrylic 
not as cold as I would like it to be. Let's see when uh, Presidium warms up. It takes quite some time. Okay, so oh, it's so dry here in California right now. The humidity is so low. I feel like I have to put lotion on myself every second. Yeah, this is not glass. This is right. Um, this is kind of acrylic. This one though, these little ones are the teardrops amethysts right here. Like this one's acrylic, but this ones are amethysts. So pretty. And this is glass, I would assume. No, actually they're not. They're not glass. All right. Well, this is very pretty nonetheless. Putting you back. This one is natural, I think. Uh, no, not as cold as I wanted to be. It was cold for a little bit. Yeah, no, this acrylic, acrylic um, kind of prayer bracelet. What is this? Huh. Do you hear? Kind of jingle bell. Hopefully silver. Let's take a look. Yeah, I think silver. At least chain is silver. Yeah, 95. And this one is... Oh, this one's also 925. Oh. This is so cute. Our first silver item of today. Beautiful. And do you know all my mystery boxes include silver? Two pound, five pounds. I have two pounds and five pounds. They're usually over two and five, but I just say two and five. They all include silver items and not like tiny earrings or maybe like something no, like this type of thing like the whole thing i want to take a look at this let's see what we have here so this is a cuff bracelet kind of a wavy cuff bracelet um ow small i can't get into it i would say like six i need to wash it it's it's clean i mean it's not scratched but it's kind of dirty i need to wash it I don't have any names or stamps on it. I don't think it's silver. No, this is not silver, but okay, cuff bracelet. American flag stretchy bracelet. I'll leave it in this. Silver tone necklace, New York, I think. Yeah, New York, right here, New York and Company. A very pretty pendant with like white cat's eye glass glass white white cat eye silver tone right yeah yeah silver tone oh this one's interesting necklace what do we have I think this is I think maybe bone I I'm always so confused I don't know let me show you closer. You guys will. Um, maybe. I don't know what it is. Maybe bone. Maybe not. But it's a surfer necklace. Okay. One more set. Yep. Set. A bronzy color, a kind of a statement necklace, very pretty, brutalist. This one's uh, pen, um, plastic, I think. Yeah. Oh, you know what? No, the register is glass. Oh, wow. Huh. The register is glass. Oh, yeah, 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 definitely. Do you hear? And we have earrings pretty these ones are hammered i don't think we have a name let's see on the back 
No, we don't have a name. Hmm, interesting set. Very interesting. Moving right along, I want to take a look at these earrings. I love the color. This is glass, definitely. Oh yeah, absolutely. Gold tone, very muted gold tone, faceted square, kind of glass cabochons or rhinestones. Real pretty, real pretty. Another baggie, let's see what's here. A bunch of chains, I think. Yeah, this is just a bunch of chains. Hmm. Wait a minute. Is it a bunch of chains or is it just one necklace multi-stranded? Let's see. Oh, I think it is. It's a necklace. Multi-stranded with different types and colors of chains. Oh, yeah. Look, it's pretty. So the bronzy, silver tone and gold tone, um, they're kind of uh, layered. One, two, three, five. Five different chains, different colors. This is cool. Like if you want to create this look of different chains. Yeah, that's nice. Okay. Another necklace. Oh, maybe silver, maybe silver. Let's take a look. Ooh, pretty, pretty. Hi, Kiki. Uh-huh. Okay, this one looks like granite. Uh, this one. Glass, okay, and the hair. So we have silver necklace. Uh okay. Right here. See, it says 95. Okay. And on the bottom, let me keep you zoomed in so guys you can see how pretty, oh my goodness, how pretty this is. This on the bottom are granites. They're not amethyst, the granites. So pretty. And the glass, very pretty. Let me put you back in your bag. Where's your bag? What happened? We're gonna be here. Another silver item. Fantastic. All right, we have a gold tone necklace. Uh, right here we have a um, puffy heart at the end. I don't think anything says on the heart. No, nothing. Otherwise, we have no name. And we have this kind of hammered stationary kind of leaf. Uh, leaf shaped dingle is at one stranded. Very pretty clean. Right. Oh, a lot of bracelets in this one. Oh, maybe silver. Ooh, ooh. All right, let's take a look at this bunch. This is pretty. Do we have another one? So this is a single earring. Looks to me like silver. And this looks to me like Labradorite. Look, see this one? Yeah. This is very cool artisan earring. I will test this one for silver, but I have a feeling it is. Let's keep fingers crossed that we have a second one. Here is another single earring, um, tiger's eye, silver tone. Hopefully we have another one, put it aside for now. Now let's see our bracelets. Magnetic silver tone with kind of a rubbery strands. I don't think there are any names. I see a couple of these ones, bingo bracelets. They're really good condition, rose gold with a knot. I think they call it like sailor's knot or something, or something else. Um, I don't know. 
very cute no um i don't see any any nails bronzy color kind of hammered um bracelet bingle bracelet not magnetic but um no stamps or no names very interesting kind of um asymmetrical bingle bracelet this one is gold tone with this kind of towers they're not even glass guys they're acrylic yellow acrylic points another bracelet um the copper one really cool with flowers right here carved flowers pretty okay let's take a look what we have here okay last one uh, gold tone with a leaf again just gold tone bingo bracelet and there's another is this silver let's see um not quite sure but very interesting necklace silver tone chain that's very cool kind of a toggle clasp but the toggle clasp is on the bottom where the pendant is we need to test it for silver not magnetic yeah we'll be testing it for silver i don't see i don't oh no look we have a stamp right here 90 this is silpata wow that's fantastic find silpata necklace really cool let's see if anything on this one i don't know i don't see anything on this one still we have silpata on this one cool very awesome another pair of earrings silver tone no name kind of uh, very nice closure i like this type of closures and right here we have like teardrops with oh my goodness let me turn it with pink kind of cat's eye pretty all right let's take a look at this chain this is most likely silver this is really nice not magnetic twisted rope solid has some weight to it very nice and what do we have here we have let's take a look we have what i don't under i don't understand what it says 95 on this one 95 italy oh i need to wash it there is something inside what is this ew so 95 Italy and right here we have 95 right there so we have a silver chain for sure but it needs to be washed it does need to be washed I don't know what it's side blue Ugh. okay I'll wash it oh this is very interesting necklace guys look at this one so we have gold tone kind of these bars it's a san diego california lizzie james very interesting closure i'm there you can see me and right here we probably have an amethyst yep amethysts very pretty necklace and this one kind of a gold tone bright and muted interesting necklace cool oh, another earring gold tone with cabochons no name putting it aside um interesting
interesting kind of necklace, kind of a choker, bronzy color. I need to like fix it with this, like this. Hold on. Let me fix it really quickly. Oop. Here we go. Here we go. Probably need uh, more. Perfect. Fixed. Let's see who made you. Oh, I don't think I've ever seen anything like that. It says Panama Jack. Hmm. I don't know who is Panama Jack, but here's the necklace. Very pretty. Cool kind of surfer look necklace. Um, another single earring with abalone. might be silver guys but we don't have another one for now putting it here uh, this one oh, a lot of hair on this one in this bag so we have a cord i don't know if it was supposed to be like this or not i'm gonna uh, no i don't think it's supposed to be tied like this let me open it it's kind of a pool necklace yeah, I see it's kind of a pool necklace. And right here we have a real stone, probably jasper. And right here we have a lucky coin. Very pretty pendant. Cute necklace. Right here is a bracelet. Multi-stranded bracelet. Goldish kind of very pretty uh, seed beads. And um, natural, um, I think... Right here we have a tiger's eye for sure. I want to know what this is. Let's take a look at this one. Glass. We have natural uh, beads gla and glass and uh, faceted beads. It's very pretty. Uh, pool closure. A few like adjustments. Really pretty bracelet. I think it can go from like six and a half, six and a half to seven and a half. Right. Here's the next pool. First, we have a bracelet, hematite bracelet, and silver tone and hematite bracelet. Small, I would say six and a half. Oh, here it, here it is, second earring. Wow, look at this. Oh, this one's you can see for sure. It's like labradorite. See right there. Really pretty, really pretty. Pair of earrings, wonderful. Let me know if you want me to test it for silver. I think those are handmade artisan ones. Uh, single earring, silver tone. I think, I think maybe silver. Okay, this one, oh, don't. Oh, this one I know not silver, but I wanna know this one tested, but it's single one for now. Oh my God, look at this one. Lorimar, earring, silver. Hope we find another one. See right there, what does it say? sterling i want to find another one these ones are pretty i might keep this one i'm not sure i might i might not sure gold on bracelet kind of a cuff bracelet but it also has pool it says gas right here so gas bracelet seven with um toggle closure and a kind of a cuff bracelet We'll need to wash it to make it pretty. Oh, this one's pretty. 
matte glass um, acrylic cabochons very pretty kind of a red color really pretty menagerie necklace nice closure gold tone very muted gold tone I don't know who made this one but it's gorgeous okay let me take this one out this one's big and I have no idea what it's made of it's multi-stranded five strands we have a copper closure lobster claw five strands of this looks like these are copper and they painted blue or greenish to make them look kind of old and antiqued really cool they're a little bit um, layered really awesome necklace uh, single another single earring aside so far um, I don't oh this one fell from this one okay let's see which one it lost I will fix it oh, right here all right so this one it's lost from this one this little one and I have it all I have this yeah so I will fix it put it right here all others are here oh perfect 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 I'll put it aside um hammer tie stretchy bracelet stretch is good um another very pretty earring with abalone circle kind of hoop dingled hoop put it aside we'll see if we'll find another one oh my goodness this magnet is bad okay let's take a look at this necklace so we have a rose gold very muted very nice rose gold chain no name and we have this pendant with rhinestones right here Yeah, I don't know who made you, but the condition is very good. Pendant is brushed a little bit. Oh, this is very pretty gold tone necklace. Um, a little bit on a greenish, yellowish greenish side, muted gold tone. A lobster claw. Fourteen twenty, so it's gold field. Fourteen carat gold field. Hmm. Oh, come on, really? I don't know what's on this sign, but is it just the closure or it's the whole necklace gold field? Because look at this. Look at this chain. Look how pretty it is. Maybe, maybe it's a whole thing is gold field. I don't know. It's very dainty. I wouldn't have, yeah, I wouldn't want to scratch it. Very dainty, very pretty. Look, look how filigree the beads are. So pretty. Looks good with my nail. Very long necklace, actually. You can wear it twice around your neck, or maybe even three times if you wanted like a choker. Yeah, look, pretty. All right, let's see this one. This one has magnetic closure, everything sticks to it. Oh my God, these are glass and real pearls. Look at this, look at this glass bead. It's painted, kind of inside. It's black one and then it covers in clear one. And then we have this facet of beads and real pearls. This is cool. I'm just kind of not fan of magnetic closure, but closure is really good, very powerful. Look at this, how gorgeous this one is. Another glass bead. This one looks like, oh wow, this one's I will need to research. This one looks like a vintage to me. We have barrel clasp and we have this graduated beads, glass beads that are painted. And they come to the uh, kind of a the biggest one on the very bottom. I'm gonna have to research it. This one's a gorgeous, gorgeous glass. I think they're glass. Yeah, they're very heavy. Yeah, glass beads, they're very heavy. Very heavy, gorgeous. I love the unique stuff like that. 
Okay, silver tone bracelet. XO. Uh, I think this one is Premier Design right there, see? Yeah, I think this is Premier Design. Or maybe it's no, it's Y B or G. I don't know. I don't know. Nothing on this side. XOs. Nothing on this side. Just this stamp. I think Premier Design. It looks to me like Premier Design. Slightly magnetic. But its condition is very clean. Um, silk beads. It's plastic beads wrapped in silk. Different color. Very pastel. Very uh, Easter colors. Very pretty. And this one will be in craft for a dollar. So gorgeous. Another necklace. Um, New York, I think. Yep, New York. Silver tone chain. And we have this acrylic yeah acrylic beads with foliage inside oh my goodness look at that <laughs> and this one's kind of um lucite and this one's really interesting yeah this two lucite beads interesting um asymmetric Kind of asymmetric Past pastel pinkish and yellowish colors let me grab this one's a lot of different earrings i can see This is like so far what I see. I think this is it for now. There might be some other inside, but this is so far what I see. Okay. First of all, we found the second of uh, this earring, a pair to this one. Let's take a look at them more in detail now that we found the pair. So they're dingle earrings with uh, two-tone chains and a bead, black bead right here. Oh, oh my goodness, my magnet. We also found another one like this, dingle earrings with black um, beads and yellow kind of cabochons right here. Uh, gold tone, no name, post dingle earrings. They would be about like two... Um, Two inches or 175. Gorge. Uh, what else? Let's see. Oh, I found second one. This right here. Small dingle hoops with abalone teardrops. Perfect. Can test it for silver if you'd like me to. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Now I have to think about it. Oh, I have to think about it. I know what I'm going to keep them for a little bit. I'm going to keep them for a tad bit. I kind of like it. Okay, if you guys want, want them, you can do dibs on them and say if you um, don't like them or don't want them, you can, um, I can sell them to you, but you can let me know if you're interested in this. I will need to fix this ear first because see supposed to be like this and it's a little crooked thing at least like like this right yeah something like that 
Yeah, I'm gonna keep it for a little bit to see because I don't have anything with um, Larimar. Oh, we found second hoop with abalone. That's a bigger hoop, a little bit bronzy color with abalone discs inside, dangle earrings. All right, now I have this um, keychain. Not quite sure what um, this made of. Maybe plastic, maybe plastic to make to look like tooth, you know, but it's very interesting keychain. Another pair of earrings. We already found one like this with clear, I think. Cat's eye or pink, don't remember. Yeah, we have found one like this with pink. Now we have like this with clear cat's eye. Or maybe it's like um, moonstone. Yeah. Where are those? Right here. See, we found with pink one. And now we found with clear one. Silver tone. Okay, let's see. Oh, nope, not the same. Okay, two pair of studs. Okay, two pair of studs. This one's kind of yellow. This one on the orangey side. They bo both have um, gold tone. They, they both, I think glass. Yeah, they're both glass. This one's our smaller orangey side, bigger or more on the yellow side, gold tone backings. Oh, this one, the big ones are Kate Spade, guys. The big ones are Kate Spades. Let me show you. See the spade sign? Yeah, the big ones are Kate Spades. Okay, here, yellow ones, Kate Spades. Let's see smaller one. And this one's a smaller one. This has this one's a kind of squarish, and this one's a kind of circleish, and this one don't have anything on the back. Yeah, this one's just like this. This ones are not Kate Spades. Okay. Now let's see what else we have here. Oh, we found second um, pair for this one. Teardrops, kind of open work, very pretty. Studs. Yeah, very pretty studs. They kind of not studs, they posts, but they have dingles. Okay. Awesome. Oh, second one, silver tone um tiger eye is here. Okay. Clear rhinestones clip on earrings. They are something's on the back. Let's see. They are LaRocco, hmm, LaRocco's Silver Tones. I, I'm not really familiar. Do you guys know anything about it? Rhinestones are here. They may, uh, they kind of on a lighter side. All the rhinestones are glass, glass rhinestones, clear, pretties, very pretties. Okay. This one is a single earring. This is glass. Kind of a cheetah looking glass bead aside. A silver tone, clear rhinestones, and teardrop purple cabochon rhinestone. Let's see. Glass. They're glass, glass rhinestones, silver tone, post, posts actually so pretty look at this look how pretty they are very pretty purple color um, half hoops uh, two-toned silver tone and gold tone with rhinestones glass no name yeah no names but they're in a really good condition very pretty. Now we have gold tone like this, gold tone and uh, kind of coral color cabochons. They are 
very hard to test. Glass. Don't see no names on the back or any stamps. But absolutely beautiful. Yeah, very beautiful. Very pretty. What else? Now we have, oh my goodness, look at this brooch. This is um, Parrot. How do you, I don't want to open them. He is very pretty, gold tone. I don't see any names, but gold tone with rhinestones, parrot, um, parrot brooch, parrot pin. Maybe something on his tail, but it's too small. I don't know. Very pretty. I don't want to open them and scratch them. Now we have a single mushroom. Silver tone mushroom earring. For now, single. And we have this one, very pretty, dangle, silver tone with rhinestones. Oh, look at this heart. Hopefully we'll find another one like this. Oh, this one's RC. Guys, it went way past glass. It went to middle of Chrysophorus. Tanzanite and aqua and end of chrysophorus. Yeah, they all went there, like middle of chrysophorus. Hmm. Very pretty. Do we have any stamps? No. It's not magnetic. Do you guys see any stamps or anything? I don't see any. Let's see, not, I don't think it's silver, it doesn't look like it. Yeah, it doesn't look like it. But here are other stones. Oh, I apologize for my dry hands. I just put lotion before I started and it's already dry. So hopefully we'll find another one. Let me put single ones aside. Okay, these ones are our single ones. Silver tone cuff bracelet, uh, kind of a snap bracelet. I want to clean it to make it more shiny, but it's in a good condition. I, I don't see any names though. A seven, seven. Very nice. Oh, snaps really good. Okay. Do we have a. J. Crew here? No. No. This is not J. Crew. It's J. Crew like. Let's take a look. So, bronzy color chain, kind of a chunky chain, a lobster claw closure, no name. We have an extender. We don't have a name, but we have a very pretty beads. You can see the white one, bright blue color. Okay, so I think there's a glass. Um, it kind of wiggles a little bit on the lower side of glass. I don't know, but it is very pretty black and white. Yeah, very pretty. Here's the back, done exactly like J. Crew. Okay, really cool necklace okay bronzy color bangle bracelet you cannot open it um gold tone i would just say even right here is very ornate we have mesh we have different decorations very pretty 
very clean you know gorgeous bangle bracelet I don't think I see any stamps or names no a little bit on the lighter side um, two twisted kind of kind of a twisted silver tone bracelet not magnetic but I don't see any stamps and I, and I am curious no this is not silver guys no it's kind of a scratches pink a little bit I think it's plated but it's not silver yeah I don't think so I think it's plated because I've seen a little bit of brown and then it went away and became blue see so yeah it's kind of like um, nickel yeah but it Cool, cool bracelet. Yeah, pretty cool. All right, now let me grab this one out. This massive bracelet. Okay, massive gold tone chain, um, chain links. This one is J. Crew with the Senorita clasp. It's massive, guys. It's absolutely massive. It does have a little bit of wear where those links uh, kind of touch each other, you know, gold tone. I can wash it because it does need to be washed. Um, yeah, that's massive J. Crew bracelet. Let me take this one out because it's chain, multicolored. Let's see who made you. Liz Claiborne, silver tone. It's actually very pretty two-toned the chains are silver tone and uh, this stations are very muted gold tone it is very pretty very clean chain necklace absolutely gorgeous very gorgeous silver tone chain let's see yep silver tone twisted rope very clean but again just silver tone Um, very interesting necklace so we have a ball chain with this flowers kind of a bunch of flowers pendant and it does have a name the name is the tag it says mason scotch i am not familiar with mason scotch i'm gonna have to research but it looks very simple um, and can you imagine you know, like look it up and it's like a bazillion amount of dollars yeah. I don't know who's missing scotch but it's bronzy color necklace all right let's do this one first so what do we have here is a necklace lobster claw gold tone we do have a tag tag says something um, tag says Jean. Oh, Joan Rivers. It's Joan Rivers. Okay, nice. Joan Rivers, gold tone uh, with glass beads. I think. I hope it's glass. Doesn't feel like it. Hold on. I don't. I don't know. It's kind of. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Some glass. Some lower glass. It's like this, see? The uh, the kind of rings with <coughs> faceted glass beads. <clears throat> Different color, but they are on a warm side, like yellow-orange. Okay, John Rivers necklace. Gold tone bracelet. Very pretty, very clean. Um... It is lobster claw, kind of older, I think, lobster claw. I don't see any names on it. Slightly magnetic, but very pretty. Stretchy bracelet, faceted glass, glass beads, silver color. Um, gold tone chain. 
slightly magnetic, very slightly, but still magnetic. Yeah, I can see the pull. No. Yeah, I don't see anything. It's just flat chain. Muted gold tone. St another stretchy br bracelet with a dangly faceted black beads and silver tone beads. Stretch is good. Uh, silver tone necklace. Slightly magnetic. I don't see anything on it. Oh, dirty fingers. Okay, the necklace is, I mean, the jewelry is very um, dirty. Okay, so just an, a chain. What do we have here? We have silver tone chain with four pearls. Four pearls are not good. And it says right here, nice tecton. I don't know. What? I thought it's a nice 18 karat gold silver plated, I think. Uh, but the, look at this. The, they, they're all scratched out. Like, I don't like it. I'm going to have to put it to, unfortunately, craft. Yeah. Moving silver tone necklace with glass beads, very pretty. Um, toggle clasp, and then we have different color beads like really pretty black, kind of a silver tone clear, and this green ones, kind of an olive color glass beads. And on the bottom right here, we have this open work decoration. It's not magnetic. Again, we'll test it. I don't see anything on it, but it's pretty. It's pretty, guys. It's really pretty. Next is hematite necklace with blue beads. Also beautiful. These blue beads are really pretty. They're not glass, I don't think so. Oh no, they are. They are. I couldn't touch them. Yeah, they are. Hematite with blue glass beads. All right, beautiful silver tone necklace. No name, lobster claw. Oh, this is gorgeous, very gorgeous. All rhinestone seems to be here. They're different, like a uh, clear and a bit yellowish. Bib style necklace. Here's the back again, no name. Very pretty. Closer. Another hematite necklace with quartz and a uh, hearts. Hard shape beads um, this one is silver tone necklace this one is it's a chain necklace what does it say here it's it's magnetic it's heavy it's kind of a on the brutalist kind of a side I, i'm trying to see what it says here and i can't figure it out Oh, Sarah Coventry. Oh my goodness, I had no idea Sarah Coventry uh, did something like that. It's very chunky, guys. It's very chunky. Good condition, plain, and hammered links. Sarah Coventry, silver tone. Oh, here we go. We found second mushroom. Second post earring mushroom, silver tone. gold tone oh my goodness this is pretty where is the neck okay here's my neck look how pretty this gold tone uh, necklace is look at this gorgeous very good condition gold tone very muted gold tone not bright lobster claw extender but there is no name Uh, 
have clip-on earrings, a rhinestone, silver tone and rhinestones, dangle with black, actually with black rhinestones on the bottom. Uh, I don't see, yeah, no name, but they look very pretty. Very pretty, it seems like all the rhinestones are here. Uh, gold tone necklace faux pearls extender uh, faux pearls and they are kind of maroon color um, this one has a little scratch right here on the paint uh, this one's let's see faux pearls but they're knotted in between they seems to be very old necklace this one's a glass um, they do have some scratches because they're all it, it is an old necklace uh, for pearls right here we have a bracelet this one is a tad bit better condition uh, this one's also faux glass uh, faux pearls glass knotted in between and they have a gold closure I mean gold tone closure let's see what it says here it says Japan perfect okay so we have this uh, bracelet faux pearls um, kind of on a creamy color Japan stretchy bracelet stretch is good muted gold tone no name nice Another stretchy bracelet, uh, silver tone kind of bars with rhinestone and faceted acrylic beads. Yeah, black acrylic beads. Stretch is good. Three strands. Um, okay. So we have this interesting mm, earrings they're posed kind of dangle earrings with chains chains are multi-colored kind of bronzy and silver tone a little bit they are not magnetic so i'm kind of assume they might be silver let's see yeah i see the backing says 925 so I, I assume these earrings are silver. I'm gonna have to see the, I'm gonna have to test them. Okay, very interesting earrings. Let me see while you close up, let's be here, kind of cool. Uh, we did not find, second ones like this i'm gonna keep them just to see maybe they're elsewhere because these are cool i'm gonna keep them aside but we found pretty few pairs today um, another hematite stretchy bracelet very good condition stretch is good and right here is the last bracelet for today toggle clasp gunmetal color we have glass beads, um, open work beads, silver tone beads, and yeah, glass beads. Nice, nice bracelet. There we go. All right, guys, this is it for today. Thank you so much for joining me and being with me right now while we're going through this bag. It was pretty cool. I found a lot of interesting things. Let me know what you think. Leave me a comment. Um, do the thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe if you like a content like this. All right, I will see you guys next time. Right? Bye bye.